back inside 585. I am your host, Be Easy. Juan HD behind the camera. Today we got fellow seven artists. My brother from another mother who gave birth to him on another planet, Eric Canal. You What's already good? know it's good. Seven page, page. Just came back from out of town and then I just picked him up from doing another show. So I mean. Grind don't stop, man. Nothing stopping. Yeah. That's supposed to go on camera, right? That's alright. This, this, yeah. this raw shit. Who gives a fuck? Right, right. That's a cigarette. It's a BB. Right. So, um, where'd you come? Where'd you just come back from? Um, I just came back from uh, North Carolina. Um, ever since I had started doing music in my hometown, um, Rock City, it's like you can only reach a certain level with without having a network. Being an underground artist, just doing music, having nothing but my music. It was a blessing to be able to touch a new city. So as soon as I got an opportunity, you know what I'm saying, I tied up a couple loose ends here, packed up in North Carolina. Shout out to North Carolina, City Live Studios, uh, Knife Wonder, and the 7MG affiliates down there. Everybody knows, it's about to get real big. So what was the reception like? They love it, son. I ain't gonna lie. It's like the same thing here. If we got the same 10 artists and somebody new comes in with skill, it's, a, it's an event, it's something dope, you know what I'm saying? So they was real receptive, and when I told them we got some more on the lineup coming, they was ready for that too. So um, the fact that they really seem to be an active underground um, community is real. That's what's up. They like it, you know what I'm saying? And they talking about it. Okay. Could you compare, how would you compare their hip-hop scene to it, to Rochester's hip-hop scene? Um, one of the biggest differences that I noticed immediately on the positive side right. is that their scene down there has a lot of community support. Like, there's a lot of venues that they was uh, able to use to do what they do. And um, one of the biggest differences is just that they weren't selling tickets, you know what I'm saying? Like, the money that came in, they had already agreed that it was gonna be chopped up. Everybody wondering how we eat off this music thing. Down there, people were asking me how much I was gonna charge them. They were like, oh, we like you, we want you to come here. How much you want? That was something new. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh shit, all right, you know what I'm saying? Um, so I was really digging that, and that's, that's that. I guess that's how they getting it in down there in Carolina, and um, I was feeling that. Like, that's a big deal. Okay. I have a question, I noticed, when I, when I see some of, some of your posts, what exactly, how would you define a canalian? Ha ah, what is a canalian? I right, see that right. a lot. And I put it a lot in my post to keep it relevant, um, but it's always current. Um, a canalian is someone who understands that in every moment of their life, there is a continual communication going on. Confusion, it's proof of a block in your flow. You're missing how what you're experiencing is communicating to you. So um, the fact that I use the term canalian is just that my name's Erie Canal. A canalian, a canal is a waterway. Right. You see I'm made out of flesh. So a canalian ain't got shit to do with me. It's people who connect to that eternal water, that flow. And um, I just happen to have a codex that I've shared through my music with people who have took the title Canalians and um, honor the fact that I'm okay at communicating some ideas that are way beyond right. the normal flow. Right. You know what so, I mean? so with that, how would you describe your music as, a, as opposed to other artists from or other artists in general, period? Um, if we're gonna connect it to the build on Canalians and then my music, I, I like the image of shamanism. Um, every word, every bar I spit has an intention behind it. And that's going to manifest in how my body presents it, how my voice forms what I'm saying. So I call it pure flow. Um, the difference in, as I said, what I'm doing, what other people are doing, a lot of people are singing songs. Right. I'm performing moments. And that's why it's a totally different vibe. You know what I mean? Yeah. Now, do you have a certain, as far as the audience, a certain type of audience that you're trying to target or it's more so you're just more so trying to get everybody yeah um i'm not i'm not, I'm not targeting an audience when i perform right. i'll perform to any audience okay i'm targeting a audience 
in my message. Mm. And it just so happens that that is a lot broader of a range than I expected at first. My heart is foster kids, you know what I'm saying? That, that outcast feeling, whether they ended up in a trap house or in a foster family, the ones who had fleet from the nest, kind of the, the Tom Sawyer, Huck Finn kind of energy, you know, that, 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 that wanderer, traveler. Um, that, that, that's pretty much, I guess, the sleeping inside of everyone. But yeah, we don't target the audience. Wherever they put me up, I got, I got something for them. Okay. Now we're just recently joining up with the Seven Music Group. Yeah. How did that, how did that come about? Because you kind of already had, before that, you kind of already had your own, your own movement going, your own fight. Yeah. So what made you decide to, to link up with Coach? Shout out to Coach. What made me decide to do that was, um, Basically, that, that ties into the Canalian thing as well. Um, being new to the music scene in Rochester and having nothing again but my music, and then now a fan base that was dialoguing directly to me. Um, I had to seek advice from those who had done it and were doing it already. And when it came time for me to say I was doing too many things at one time, everybody claims that mogul shit, because it's cool, it's on VH1, it's on BET, oh, I'm a mogul, I run my own business, I do this, I do that, I hear you. I was actually holding up that kind of construct and I wasn't as effective as I should have been. So that's what humility says, you're good at this. I have to be good at it because I don't have people I can trust to do that part for me. When you see someone whose vibration is harmonious and they're willing to take those steps with you, all you have to do is um, stand. So at that moment I, I asked coach, I said listen man, I see what you're doing. Let me rock with the seven, man. You see the Canalias, they trust my judgment. And I trust my judgment. So, with that being said, you can't, no man is an island. We all create islands. Aha. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? Right. Now, I see that you also, you seem like you tour quite a bit. Is that as far as being an artist in this industry? Is that something you enjoy more so than, let's say, like the recording process and finishing up music? Like um, what, what more so, as far as being an artist, what do you enjoy most? Is it the performance portion of it, or hitting that booth, laying something down, no flat? Get that music out. <laughs> I had to throw that out there. Um, I enjoy <coughs> performing probably more than anything. Right. Enjoyment. <coughs> to see the comprehension. Mm -hmm. To see someone connecting to right. you as you unveil the tale you're sharing with them. Right. Nothing gonna touch that. Nothing gonna touch that. Okay. Um, I have to put my energy most into that recording process because that's where <clears throat> we perfect what we're about to present. Right. But nothing, nothing ever gonna beat the beat. You know what I'm saying? Right. So right. you see him vibing to the beat in the back. Yeah, that's that. Yeah. Shouts to Piles on the production. Everything in house. Come on. Yeah. It's just, is it, it's, is it, with all the shows that you've done, is there any particular song that you just, like, when you, when you perform that particular song, you get more of a reaction on the song? Is there one song like you just feel like any show you have to do that song? Yeah. There's a, yeah, there's, there's probably two, and they're both on different polarities. I have a song called Lovely Grief that um, the hook goes, when I die, I don't care if nobody grieves for me, because I can't smell the flowers that they leave for me. That, just that kind of energy spread into a room through loudspeakers. Slowly and deliberately is a song that is really magical in it. And um, it frightens me sometimes because words, you know what I'm saying, fall as footprints. Um, and that's a song that people really connect to. And I call, I, I introduce them to the Nile Valley before I perform that track, which is why it's one that every time I'm doing a live show, I like to perform it. I like to invite them to the Nile Valley to show them we're transporting some way different. And the other one is a track called Genesis. Everybody got a life story track. I don't know how many people truly love their life story track enough to perform it at all their shows. I try to, to immediately um, unveil so that they can get the shock out of their system and now we can honestly dialogue with the music. So, what do we got upcoming from Mary Canal? Um, upcoming is uh, more shows. More shows, of course, <laughs> but but not as many, man. That's one thing I'm, I'm working on. Um, I really had to decide as an artist that I really was going to do music full time. Mm -hmm. That being the case, I had to start paying. 
Um, when you're performing a lot, most of those performances aren't paid. So yeah. I'm going to pull back my presence on stage a little bit um, just to demand what people are already saying I'm worth. Um, what's next is a uh, mixtape. We're going to call it a Nightcrawler. And um, we're going to bring the, my favorite X-Men character to life and show them that, you know, what they have painted as demon is sometimes a saving spirit. Um, it's very necessary in these these transformational times we live in. Um, I'm still waiting on the release of my film, King's Faith. Y'all check that out. Kingsfaith.com. Um, that's going to be a big thing. And that's something, again, we have to claim our presences. That movie is being held up for reasons I may not know for a while. And that's because I'm not a part of those dialogues. So now I'm choosing to be a part of more business dialogues in my career. So um, the film, we're gonna wait for that to hit theaters soon, you know, whatever. And um, the night problem is we're gonna put that together real nice. And you have it. Seven Music Group, Larry Canal, Be Easy, Wine HD, Pounds. Say hi, Mix. Hi. Just throw words out before we go. Those of you who have paid attention to Inside 585 know we always end it off with a flow session. Pound's got the beats playing in the background. Holla at him if y'all need some beats. So from there, we're gonna let him take it. Already. Already. Parasite. All these parasites trying to lock me down Too bad, I'm already flowing, can't stop me now Perpetual motion mean, my words flow like an ocean Everybody hear them words Get ripped open, I'm a lumberjack Tear the trees down and see clearer Look inside the glass mirror Start to fear yourself I guess you want the wealth that they gave you Since they name you, they can slave you and name you I'm a jack of all trades inside my hand to hold the power For each hour, six zero, this is not devoured Quality ciphers will all balance on the water When they choose to bring the slaughter I'll get furnished from my daughter In the refrigerator Mad food and mad grub Mad hugs Mad niggas in the club with mad love Black hood guns Mad snubs Black hoodies up Niggas tuggied up We don't give a fuck So get your buddies up Huh I guess nobody loves you, nobody chooses to care Probably wasn't nobody there Microwave but Now, when you're facing a microwave life It's like I turn the heat up and your body cooks twice Sour diesel. Hot on the inside, you pale on the top That's sour diesel I got the ale for the drop If you want to sip a twist the pip and smoke and get lifted I'm still gifted Even right, when I write my words twisted Like my city rock It's all gutter, it's all dirty, it's all early It's shine, we got the birdie, it's our time Go check it it's like the golden chains or the snitch it from Harry Pocket, Harry Potter's pickets, garbage. signs, garbage, like rats when they playing. What I'm saying, everything I do is now spraying. It's like a sprinkler, it's all timed, it all falls in the dirty off. bitches. From the heart, we start to spark. Dirty bitches, turn them all clean. Now she a queen, she getting money for the team, you know what I mean? She's stacking up crazy green. It's like stacks on backs and racks on mattresses. Chicks that's now turned actresses. Unbelievable. Uh, it's unbelievable the way we so receivable. Open up, it's not conceivable for you to leave a fool. Anything, I probably empty it all. Steve empty Jobs, home. my name written on the wall. Steve Jobs is how my brain works. See my shit is sparking, ignoring. Uh, that shit moving, wanna start grooving and stop cruising. We never losing. The same one you choosing is the one I'm now bruising. Mike Tyson, Bing bang, Tyson punches. I bite the ears so you can hear me clear. Climbing up the stairs. Creepy call, nighttime, hey, body scared. That's okay, we prepared. You was never yes. there when I saw you. Gangsta movie, these dudes popping poses, but they not really dead roses, they froze. What I mean, ice grills mean nothing. This camera starts steaming. I guess that mean my brain started beaming on linoleum. Can't get rooted, can't feel the dirt. Still, my lyrics hurt. You stupid jerks, you need to go back to work and start writing. Make your pen move across the page. Cause we just set the stage. It's all right. Getting laid, lay it down, fit it hat, twist it that, fit it back. Now they want the snap back. That's okay, we snap attack. Water bottles, and it's a berserker barrage. <laughs> oh. a bottle water used to be free, now they charge you a fee. Go on! <laughs>
You want to contact me, get with me at myeriecanal.com. M Y E E R I E C A N A L.com. That's going to link you to my Facebook. Um, just go there, that's the home for everything Erie. Um, if you want to go to YouTube, it's My Erie Canal. Because I'm yours, and anything I do is for you. Welcome to Pure Flow. Party, my